deep event. Uh, you know, I think Brazier got through there. You can never count him out. Uh, Clayton, Clayton's tough. Uh, a lot of these young guys have a lot of racing experience this year. They, they play well in NCAAs and stuff. So uh, it's going to be deep. Uh, I'm excited to, to definitely finish again against this guy. Well done. Thank Congratulations. It felt good. Uh, you know, surprised nobody really wanted to run. Uh, I did, Sorry to say that I'm surprised nobody wanted to go with it. Yeah. I mean, uh, which is fine. I mean, 52 for me is a jog. It's not like having Dwayne and, and Boris in there where we're going 49.5, 50 flat. So, you know, I felt easy. Uh, if it goes like that in the final, I like my chances. Uh, I was able to shut it down with like 75 to go. I had a, had a good good gap there, uh, put a little surge in, was able to see where I was. I mean, it seems like you've yeah. run like, pretty much 145 every, every time out. Yeah, yeah. I mean, do you feel like you have a high gear? Yeah, um, you know, I said this a couple times. I feel more prepared this year than I've ever been. Um, I haven't raced as much. Uh, I've been banged up a little bit the last couple of years, just some nagging things. We've worked on some some stuff biomechanically. I feel like my form's a little bit better. The last hundred's definitely been been better this entire year. So, uh, you know, I like I like my chances if I'm there with anybody with time to go. Yeah. So, you, I mean, you made the team in 2015. Yeah. How important is, is winning? Because you never won one out. I mean, the goal every single race you step on the line is to win. Uh, to win an outdoor title would be awesome, especially against a field like this. Uh, I mean, I'm going to go for it, put myself in the mix like I always do, and uh, we'll see how the race plays out. But I mean, I'm excited where I'm at. The first two rounds went really well, exactly as we expected. So. All right. Nice job today.